Hey, what's going on miners? Today we're going to be checking out triple mining Ergo, Ironfish, and Zill. So let's get right into it. As a crypto miner, you know you want your equipment to be high quality. Proper cable management is part of your mining rig, and the Veteran Miner has you covered. The Veteran Miner cables are created with the best materials to ensure they are of the highest quality. Our cables are made of 16 gauge tin copper, ensuring another layer of protection from oxidation and corrosion. We support our products with a 100% guarantee. Visit our website at www.theveteranminer.com and get the best cables for your mining setup. All right, guys. So there was a comment made in the live stream with Panda with my 4070s. And then I like I got to thinking a little bit. And then I was just like, you know, I was just kind of just enjoying the stream and stuff like that, hanging out with everybody. And then I really sat down and thought about it. This guy was mining Dynex and Ironfish with Zill. And I'm like, okay, Dynex, CPU, core intensive, right? But so is Ironfish. So that made no sense to me. So I tried it with the SRB miner. It doesn't work worth a crap. You can't, I don't know why you're going to triple mine two core coins, right? So, um, so I tried it out and this is the only... Uh, miner that supports triple mining for Ergo, Ironfish, and Zill right now uh, for NVIDIA. So there's two supporting for AMD. There's Team Red Miner and uh, obviously uh, SRB Miner because SRB does AMD and NVIDIA. So let's go ahead. Let's head over to the uh, to the computer here and let's go ahead and check it out. So... <clears throat> You can see that my couple of rigs I have here, because <laughs> um, my units just shipped today on FedEx Freight, so I'm getting my whole farm back from Terra. So there will be a lots more rigs to be populating here, lots more GPUs coming online. Um, sometime, probably mid to late uh, next week. So this is just what I'm working with right now. So um, yeah, let's get into it. So on the test bench here, uh we have uh we have two forty seventies we have the Asus and the PNY. Now I did attempt to do this in the flight sheet with their commands, but it didn't make a difference, right? Um so it just it's you could tune it this way, you could tune it in the minor config. It honestly doesn't make a difference for this part because you're essentially using the entire GPU as a whole, right? So that's not going to really make a difference here. But these are my numbers that I got. And I would say they're mildly profitable. And there's obviously room for improvement here. I, I, I let this thing go on its auto tune. So SRB miner here. I'll, sh I'll even restart the miner here so you guys could see like how this actually works, right? There's an auto tune feature. And... um you know you can adjust that feature i left it as stock just as is and it seems to do i'm going to say a pretty decent job obviously with manual tuning you could definitely get better probably but we'll wait for this here to to start up here and you could see what happens with this is is it starts to do intensity and it slowly kind of ramps up it probably takes like i don't know anywhere from five to ten minutes um to, to get it going so you can see down here gpu zero gpu one auto tune started and then it's going to start doing this intensity thing and it goes all the way up from like one to even over a hundred it'll even maybe kind of push its limits and then if it sees that it's too hard it'll just it'll back itself off <clears throat> so we that is essentially dual <laughs> So that's essentially we are triple mining right now as you can see we are connected to all the pools we're connected to the fly pool we're connected to hero miners for ironfish and we're connected to crazy pool for the zill um so you could find uh we're over here at the srb uh miner github i'll leave this link down below if you guys want to use srb to triple mine like I said, Ergo, Ironfish, and Zill with your NVIDIA cards. Um, you want to come down here in the parameters. And they do have quite a bit of parameters here. 
but you could kind of skip through it. But this is where you add Zill. So these are the, the, the special Zill parameters. Um, and then if you want to do like your GPU, um, you know, core offset and like, you know, lock cores and stuff like that, this, this uh, GPU OC parameter section is how you set the parameters and, and stuff like that. So just so you guys could kind of figure that out if you guys want to do that. So now let's get into what does the flight sheet look like, right? Because you guys are probably just going to want the flight sheet. You guys don't have to copy my overclocks. You guys can do whatever you want, right? I'm still testing, right? I'm not saying that this is the best, but it's pretty optimal for, for, for me, right? I'm at 8 cents kilowatt right now. Well, technically, am I like here? We'll even get like down to the nitty gritty here. I'm probably at like 7, 8, or not 78 cents. Whoa, that's way too much. <laughs> 0.078 cents, right? So uh i'm profiting about 27 cents a day uh it's costing me about 58 cents to run but the cool part is though is we're generating three different coins right so we could probably mine some other stuff and be a tiny bit more profitable not by a lot um but this way we're actually mining and we're getting like three different coins right instead of just like one coin so this way we could kind of stack all of these bags. You know, we could stack the Ergo, the Ironfish, the Zill, kind of like all in one right here. So I think that's pretty good. So this is our hash rates here. Uh, we're getting, well, I put 245, but 246.9 and 17.7 is what we're doing right there. And I have 17.56. So, I mean, we can even increase these numbers like a little bit right you know what i mean the other one was 246 we'll recalculate i mean you still at like 27 cents so it's profitable right it'll probably it'll be profitable i think until you hit probably i'm gonna say 11 and then it's probably gonna get negative nope it's profitable at 11 cents you're making six cents a day so probably 12 it'll go negative um so flight sheet we're over here at the flight sheet and let's go ahead and click the edit button so it's pretty basic right now you know you got your main coin ergo dual coins going to be iron fish but then you want to come in over here into the minor config now when you turn on the dual coin here which this is this is extremely annoying <laughs> that when you turn on this dual coin for some reason it doesn't come over here i don't understand it i don't know why so what you need to do is, is you'll have to come to the second coin and all of this will be blank. You want to come down, click Blake three iron fish, just hover over the eye and click the, uh, the wall percentage. Come over here, hover over here, do worker name Come over here, do URL, pro, uh, the URL, uh, percentage. Now that's only the only way that the URL percentage is going to work is if you pick the pool right here, if you're going to put your own custom, you know, port in here for a new pool or something this is where you're going to put it now <clears throat> this is where you're going to put the commands for your zill so it's going to be dash dash um uh dash it's going to be dash dash zill dash enable and then below that we're going to do the, the wallet right uh, which is going to be dash dash zill dash wallet with your zill address you're going to do the dash dash zill dash pool and then I added the stratum in, in TCP because this is the TCP, um, this is the protocol for it. So you may be able to take this off, but I added, I added it in there just to make sure it got connected. And then you click apply changes and you'll be hashing away. And if you need to figure out how to mine a crazy pool, I'll leave this link down here. Uh, if you want to mine your Zill, the crazy pool here this is they have this how to get it started and this is all the ports and addresses and everything like that so i'll leave that link down below as well so that's it guys it's a really basic video super easy to do um i think it's pretty good man i i, I want to start getting into more triple mining double mining uh coins here as long as it's profitable right as long as it's profitable then we'll we'll move into this sector right here and uh 
yeah we'll do it this way because this way we're just we're kind of just building those bags just a little bit right we're getting that little like extra cake of zil you know what i mean we're getting we're getting ergo we're getting iron fish all right guys so that is it that's going to complete the video today it's pretty simple straightforward video nothing too crazy um i'm just getting into more some more uh dual triple mining stuff sometimes people can get tripped up on the uh on the minor configs so um yeah if you guys need an example there it is uh i will attempt to leave the minor config arguments in the description but we'll see if youtube will allow me or not to do that or not all right guys this is the money giving you the most hashes and i'll see you next time